Now at 11, a shocking twist in the carjacking of a homestead woman in Central Florida. A deputy has been arrested. CBS News Miami's Yvonne Taylor joins us from Homestead. He talked to a relative of the victim whose birthday is today. The victim, Catherine Guerrero de Aguas Vivas, would have turned 32 this Monday. She worked at a family business, a hair salon in this city. Now the owners fear for their life. But we're going to start first with the latest from the Seminole County Sheriff. No longer looking for the car. We still are looking for information about people who are occupants in the car. The car is this green 2002 Acura, the one used in the kidnapping of Catherine Guerrero de Aguas Vivas at an intersection in Winter Springs. Seminole County Sheriff Dennis Lemma said the car was also connected to the murder of a tow truck driver in Orange County. At the scene, there are more than 100 rounds, but a good percentage of those rounds on the ground are 10 millimeter. The gun used in the murder uh, of our victim that we found burnt up in the vehicle in Osceola County. Deputies say the murder happened a day before the homestead woman was carjacked at gunpoint. Authorities believe her body was found in a burned out car at a construction site in Osceola County, but an official identification is pending. Ella trabajaba aquí y un dolor muy fuerte. She worked here. We are under so much pain. It's affected all of us, said this woman who identified herself as a relative and one of the owners of the salon in Homestead. Se anda diciendo muchas cosas feas de ella. We are hearing ugly things about Catherine, which are not true. This woman told me the tragedy has affected the business. They have been losing clients. An Orange County deputy was arrested by the Seminole County Sheriff's Office. Deputy Francisco Estrella and his wife were arrested. Authorities say they're friends with the victim's husband. The deputy is accused of lying that he was a detective on the case to get information for the family. At the Orange County deputy and wife uh, accessed illegally uh, the Florida David system and pulled, pulled up the unique characteristics, home address, photographs, signatures of our primary detective working the case. And according to Seminole County Sheriff's Office, the victim's husband is cooperating in the investigation. He is not considered a suspect. In Homestead, Ivan Taylor, CBS News, Miami.